So from the beginning, 277 and 270 was about building a device to accomplish a task. Originally, it was kind of rubber bands and tongue depressors and paper clips. You had springs, you had wood, you had metal, and you'd build a mousetrap. This is a mechanical engineering design class at MIT. We give each one of them a kit of materials. The students call it a bag of junk, but we spent quite a bit of time thinking about what's in the kit. The task is really to grab this peg and try to put it into that square hole. Do it! Yeah! The competition is very tough, and the ideas over here were, were really incredible. The real innovation was to make sure that you not only designed it, but you built it. It's the class I've been waiting for. I think it's the class that every mechanical engineering major wants to do like as soon as they declare mechanical engineering. The reason why I chose mechanical engineering is because I like making things. This is the class where you make things. This is what I went to MIT for. It's the first time Mackey students at MIT are coming in contact with the big machines in the workshop. And this is really the class where you take everything that you've learned in those lecture halls and you put it to use. Okay, it is time to design. When I took 007 over, I was very honored because this is a historic class and I think it embodies the spirit of MIT. It's the first experience students have designing something on their own. I'm starting to see how what I'm learning applies to the real world. This class represents the MIT's model, mind and hand, exactly. So the theme this year is Hack to the Future, which features a giant DeLorean on the game board. We build the competition around good mechanical engineering principles like climbing hills, optimizing power, managing friction, but all the time mix in cutting edge new engineering innovations. Now it's chips and electronics as well as things like 3D printing. They actually get to program the robot using microprocessors. It's what the world is doing right now. This is such a real life experience for the students. They're making something that works perfectly on paper and then performs terribly in real life. Oh. 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 It hurts. And that's what happens to all of us as engineers. This class is as mech -y as you get, creating physical objects that can operate in the physical world. And I think that is the core definition of what mechanical engineering is. Some of the stuff that stayed the same is the wonderful way you compete like crazy, but help each other in the process. You'll take out time from working on your own robot and help someone else with theirs. Good job. <laughs> At the end, you celebrate course two and you like celebrate what you did and you show it off. I definitely feel more like a mechanical engineer. The enthusiasm and the passion that students have to build these robots, to get down in that machine shop, get their hands dirty, and build real things. This is the true spirit of 2007.